this out here. Yeah, but you know, it's your boy Photo Hustle Boy, man. I'm definitely in the building, man. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to everybody that fucks with your boy Photo Hustle Boy. DJ, D Banks, Pussy Bitch, Weirdo, whatever the fuck you call me. <laughs> I, I I call you. But it is what it is. And I'm sitting here with, you know what I'm saying? You know, my, you know. my pops, you know, Kane, huh? E. Williams and shit, you know what I'm hey, saying? Man, but uh, yeah, we sit here cracking these motherfucking beers and you know, just hey, having hey, a good man. old conversation. I know it might not be no way for me to go get it. He on that motherfucking horn. I said, I know it might not be no way for me to go get but it. Like I'm saying, there was a difference between real niggas and niggas that want to be real. You know what I'm saying? And, and, and real niggas, you know... We we do what the fuck we we want, you know what I'm saying? Other niggas do what they can. By the way, niggas niggas is gay with that that old stupid ass know, shit, man. man. You pussy ass niggas. Look, look, right. don't be screaming hustle boy and don't be screaming none of that gay shit. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? We don't do that. Now, like, back what I was saying, like I was saying, yeah, yeah, hear me and Kane, you know what I'm saying? We we want to shit. Like you said, there was real niggas and Wells. Wells, you saying? There's there's real niggas and there's niggas that's not real. You know no. what I'm saying? So, that's 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 the way it's, that's the way it is. No, but like I said, but life tells you a story. You can't be fake about your life. You can't. You can't. I mean, because when you, you fake about your life, then you're living a lie. Every day you're living a lie, and you're making it bigger instead of take, taking your time, thinking about it, and getting real with yourself. Because right, right, right. that's all I've been trying to do is get real with myself. I, every time I get knocked down, I got to get real with myself all over again just to get back where I was. Right, you know? right. I mean, and they say if you uh, they say if you tell a lie long enough, that it becomes the truth. And that's 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 a hard a hard pill a hard pill to swallow. Cause if you think about it, that is very true. A motherfucker sat there, he had lied to himself so much that he be thinking it's real. But I mean, no, that's just like DK. Hey, she could lie all these years, man. Right. But all this is coming to her face. Yeah. And there's no way, as long as y'all live, each one of y'all live, there's no way. She she got to take this to her grave. She got she to. She has to. She's hurting. She's, she's hurting. hurting. She's literally hurting. she's hurting. And, Clear. You know, I mean, like I said, if she'd have moved back here, I would have came back here, but I wouldn't have thought about messing with her. I would have loved to seen y'all, like I seen y'all at Joe Harvey's Harry funeral. But other than that, we walked away from that day, and I ain't got to see y'all since then until y'all started popping in on me again. You know. But you know, I was stick around. You know I mean, Tony saying? came. Tony came up here with. Deanna, you came to see me, so I mean, hey, I'm happy. The two I wanted to see, I mean, I loved it, would have loved to see Donnie Kim, but, you know, the only one I didn't want to see was Donnie K. Yeah. That was the only one I didn't want Shout to see. Shout out to my big sister, Kimberly, you know what I'm saying? I'll be coming to see you and the shit in a minute, man. You already know the third and the shit, you know what I'm saying? We're going to... We're going to do some big things and shit. Got some stuff for well, shit. You know birthday. what I'm saying? Yeah. I'm glad you're going down there yeah, on my yeah. birthday. Yeah, yeah. I'm going down there on Kane's birthday. Wow, how ironic is that? That is fucking oh, awesome, oh, bro. Yeah. How the shit? The nigga's you good, man. My In my birthday. own way, you know what I'm saying? The, the nigga's the shit. Um, you better ask about me. I am the <laughs> shit, nigga. Oh, Pass the toilet paper, homie. I'm the um, shit, nigga. But yeah, man, I'm just out here. I'm in the attic right now, man. Chopping it up, man. I'm in the yeah. hood. Apple, you know, Apple Gates. In fact, this problem, this these projects that I'm in right now, this is where we didn't even go when we was kids. We was in Locust Drive. Apple Gates was more for the the the, the people that had money, I guess. You know what I'm saying? So we didn't come over here much. It's, it's crazy that you know what I'm saying. My pops live in this motherfuckers now and shit. See how times change? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, we was talking about time earlier, change and shit earlier and shit. You know what I'm saying? Project, because a project. Yeah, yeah. Because this nigga, you know, he, he you know, know my, no, I got to get back because it's he's old. From project, old in the motherfucker. No, we had like what? Three houses, four. Yeah, four, four. Well, four. What was the house. best house we lived in? As you thought, and shit. You know what well, I'm saying? It was the one on Ninth Street. Ninth. Is that Ninth and Raleigh? 
the one with the glass in the back. And we could sit outside and watch them play basketball. Baseball. 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 Right there in Raleigh then. Yeah. Right, right there in Raleigh and shit. Yeah. yeah. You know what I'm that saying? was the best one that we ever had. That's the one that burnt yeah. down. Because of the stuff in the basement. Didn't nobody know about Donna K. Didn't want to tell Tommy to go down there and clean that water up from down there in that basement. <laughs> but the landlord told us, he said, man, it might get wet down here. So right, you got to right. get that away from that furnace. So that Donna K. didn't tell him, man, the whole house down. Luckily, we, hey, it was probably, it was like fucking real Y'all good was that gone. we wasn't in that motherfucker. Was gone. We was gone, but we could have died. You know what I'm saying? In fact, it's 2016, man. You know, I could have died a million times and shit right now and shit. Well, I remember when I got hit by a car, yeah, man. Car. You know what I'm saying? That yeah, car. shit. Yeah, 1980, PC. fucking, I want to say four yeah, or five or some PC. shit, man. Yeah. And this is how crazy times was day. back she in the day. day. Yeah, this is how times crazy was. You know, times was crazy back in them day, man. Look, my brother and sister and shit, they had asthma real bad, right? So these motherfuckers, they wouldn't miss a week of school. These niggas would be missing like half a year of school because they was always in the hospital and shit. And back in them days and shit, you can run a motherfucking letter and shit to the schools and shit because we were so poor we didn't have a motherfucking phone, right? So we would, my mom would have to write a letter and shit and I'd run it up and shit. One day I would just go into school doing everything. I always did the same old shit. But this day I decided to cross a hill. Kids, do not ever cross the street on a hill. It's not a great idea. It's never a great idea. And when so, you say stay out the street? Stay the fuck out the goddamn street. And bitches, no, keep why? your kids out the goddamn why? street. So, no, so, little man, little man, little man. There was this Seriously. hill, and it went like this. I don't care. I decided watch to cross the in the middle of the anyway, motherfucker. You, you can be on flat ground, but watch the car. This lady come up over the watch hill. Because I, I got hit right there on the table. She table. hit me. I flew a block. And, there's no exaggeration in it. In fact, I wish the white guy was here to actually see it because there was two white guys that was waiting on the bus to go to high school to actually, that lived on the corner. I remember it was a yellow house and shit. And these motherfuckers were standing there and watched the car hit me. It, I flew a, a block. Boom. Now, laying in shit, fuck myself up. You know, I didn't, I didn't bring no bones and shit like that. You know, not being funny, but I'm hard like that. But I didn't bring no bones and shit. I fucked up my face. But that's why I'm so sexy today. That's probably right. Not right either. But you know what I'm saying? But yeah, but anyway, so I, I, I landed and shit. I remember, I remember waking up. Cause the bitch hit me. Yeah, she hit me. You know what I'm saying? I was in probably in the fourth, fifth grade. She hit me. And knocked me out. Obviously, when I hit the fucking concrete, you know, no human being actually lives or fucking actually stays awake and shit after they hit concrete. After you flew in the fucking air, landed. There was a church there. Mind you, the church is not there right now. Division Street. If you from Atchison, anywhere. Lauren's house. Yeah. Who? Lauren Green's house. Lauren Green's house right there. Boom. That's how I flew a block, bro. I landed. Boom. I woke up. I remember my mama. Donna Kay. I remember I woke up for a glimpse minute and I looked up and she was standing in her nightgown and then I passed back out and shit, you know what I'm saying? But I, re you know, that was it, you know? So kids, you know what I'm saying? Stay your ass out the street, man. But like I said, that was one of the times I died. You gotta wait that. Cause you was, in the, you was in the daytime that time, bro. I don't know, you could die in a cave in a nightgown. Wait a she, minute. Cause she, because look, no. look, 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 look. Because there was a lady, I don't know, I don't remember the lady's name. She ran to the house. It was a hood critic. Yo, mama she didn't ran wear to the, Listen, listen. Yes, yeah, she she had one on that night. She ran to the house. It was early in the morning. It was like really early in the morning. It was daylight saving times. Say so that means it was probably like six, but it was still dark. Something like that. No, dude. No? When you went to school that morning. It was eight early time. that morning. It about eight, yeah, eight morning. You remember you went to school and you just you when you went up that hill, you went up that hill halfway, and the car came off that Dad, hill. To she come had down. a fucking nightgown on. I remember she had a nightgown. Hey, hey. Maybe a, a robe or something. Maybe it was something. I remember. Yeah, I, mean, I woke up lived, and she you know, was like, "When you got hit, we lived right there across the street from Ada Riley, in that white house." Right, and the old lady come running to the house, talk about, oh, oh, Donna, Donna, your kid just got hit by a car. His brains is all over the floor. So she come running up the street, and obviously my brains wasn't all over the floor because I'm talking to you right now. But 
And then I remember I got shipped off to the hospital and shit, you know, and, and Kenny Wilcox, shout out to Kenny Wilcox and shit, you know what I'm saying, he was there, and to this day, I do not. He followed me to the end of that shit. Kenny followed me through the whole damn day. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I was there through all that shit, man. <laughs> I'm telling you, man. It's crazy. Uh, yeah, I mean, it was, it was, it was crazy because it scared me because I seen me getting hit. And that's what was really hurt. And see, like I said, on the flat street, the car missed my cousin and got me. And when it got me, it knocked me up right to the corner of the bar. I bounced off that bar, and as the car was turning, I flew right back up under. And they had to jack the car up to get me out. I was almost pronounced dead. So when that car hit you, you thought about me getting hit by the car? Yeah. yeah, and I, I guess mean, you. Can, I, mean, I guess it, it, it's yeah. logic. It makes sense and shit. Yeah, I mean, no, because when, when I got hit, when I got hit, when I got hit, yeah, that lady come to your house. She came to the house. I mean, yeah, she, when who let y'all know? Who let you and Donna know? No, who was that? Because uh, who was that? Somebody uh, had to let y'all know. Yeah, well, somebody right across the street, right there as you go up that hill. Damn. Was you smoking weed when she came to the house? Man, I was high. You was high as fuck. I mean, it was all. I mean, still, right. like I said, I remember it was early that because morning because be I, I gotta get up when I get up. I to never go told on my you hustle. this. I never. No, when I get up to go on my hustle, you know, that was my first thing. Was right. I got high. Well, go to get on my grass cut. I got high. I'm sitting right here, and it's uh, it's uh, happened to be Thanksgiving, and this is a true story, and. Can't may not know it, you know what I'm saying? But then again, you know what I'm saying? It is what it is. But I remember, remember how you used to keep your weed underneath the fucking um the the, the couch all the time on the tray? Yeah, there we yeah. went upstairs. Well, we stole some of it and made a joint and shit, you know what I'm saying? So, I thought I'd let you know. And we me and my brother rapped about this and shit. I was like, one of these days I'm gonna have to let him know. But it was because of you that I started blowing kill. You know what I'm saying? It's because of this dude right here, you know what I'm saying? I was I was like knee high to a maggot. You know what I'm saying? Like a little B dude and shit. They, they really you know what I'm saying? But that's Pops, year. man. Shit. Shout out to that nigga Eddie Kane and shit. Being in my life, man, the nigga was there, man. He really, 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 really taught a nigga how to hustle. You know what I'm saying? I'm talking about some hustle shit. And we ain't talking about selling weed and fucking, fucking cracking all that old bullshit. Man, this nigga was a hustler for real, bro. Right now, my nigga. Raking leaves, shoveling snow, cutting grass, doing whatever the fuck. We talking knocking on people's doors, bro. This, that's the definition of a hustler. That's a whatever, hustler. Whatever, you know what I'm saying? Whatever season it is. Whatever season it work. is. You got to bring the motherfucking money in, man. You got to. Thank you. This is a motherfucking hustler. These, when you when you hear the word hustle, you got to think of motherfuckers like these niggas, man. This nigga will be 60 years old in two years. Like, can you, so, so put yourself in the 60 years old shoes. You feel me? So, and this was the nigga that grew a nigga up, you know what I'm saying? Or he was there, you know what I'm He was with, you know what I'm He was with Donna K. You know what I'm saying? The chick that actually, you know, pushed me out of her name. You know what I'm saying? And all that. But you know what I'm saying? So but but he was he was the man and shit. You know what I'm saying? And, and you know, we're gonna shoot you in the neck, Donna K for doing that bullshit. But that's another story. Y'all watch out for the motherfucking book called Lifeline. You know what I'm saying? My dad's gonna be in there because you know that's how we're gonna start, man. It's gonna be the truth. It's gonna be the motherfucking video. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You fuck with your boy, man. You know what I'm saying? All that old bullshit, these niggas is on some bullshit. The clothing line, hustle boy. It's coming. Called Hustle Gear, Hustle Boy on there, Hustle Girl, and Baby Hustle. We definitely out here doing it real B.I.G. on a baby that's scale. And, and you that's, feel me? And that's another thing. Like it's when Donna over your came, head like a motherfucking shower yeah. nozzle, son. When she called me and said, "Well, Eddie, uh, uh, can you go to for the divorce papers because I don't know where they're. I mean, well, I mean the marriage papers. Hey, I didn't take them. She did. She had them the whole time. And that, I, I that's heard, ironic that you still got heard, his last Tommy. name after all these motherfucking years, man. Like, like you know what I'm saying? I'm stuck. Stuck. Because he wanted to divorce plenty of times. I'm stuck. But, but she won't know. kick in with the papers. Uh, she can't. She can't find them. She can't Tommy. find them. Time you got for a little But it's hundred dollars down. to get them done. No, I remember my it bitch. It I remember my I bitch. I went down there right now. I went, I went down there. I'm the divorced to my bitch shit. Yeah. Hey, for I, went down there. I had to pay so, for I went it. down there and they told us they couldn't find our records. Come on in. 
kidding me. I remember I had to pay for it. Yeah, yeah, fuck you, Tanya. You know what I'm saying, Tanya Davis, you bitch. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, you know what I'm saying. I remember I, it cost me a hundred and shit, but it is what it is. It's shit. It's your boy for the husband's boy. <laughs> That's good. Yeah, Thanksgiving.